My name is Alessandro Rabottini and I'm artistic director of the 22nd edition of MiArt. MiArt is the international fair of modern and contemporary art that the Fiera Milano uh, promotes in the city of Milan. And I'm particularly happy to open this new edition of MiArt today. Uh, for the first time, like MiArt features 174 international galleries all active in the promotion of modern and contemporary art and limited edition design. Um, I am really proud of what we did. I shouldn't be the one saying that, but uh, many, many international galleries from Barbara Gladstone to Sadie Coles, Michael Werner, uh, decided to show either for the first time in Milan or are coming back from previous edition. And I think that this gives us a sort of a look, the feeling of what is happening in Milan at the moment as an international hub of creativity. Milan has always been like the city of design, fashion, architecture, modern and contemporary art. I think that Milan is now living uh, a very special moment, very energetic, very international. And I think that Mi Art has been conceived from Fiera Milano and from the entire team that I'm coordinating because we have a lot of collectors and we have a lot of uh, curators involved in the different sections. Mi, Mi Art has been conceived as a sort of an amplified portrait of what Milano can be perceived internationally. So this is why we have this very specific very eclectic blend of very different positions. We have from very emerging galleries to very established galleries, all living together in the same space. And I think that this is like a very nice way to reflect the moment that we are re witnessing, that we are living. But this is also why the reason, uh, because we wanted to expand the chronology of the fair and offer something that is really broad we have a number of sections and each one activates a, new, a different type of audience. And we go from the very beginning of the last century to the very latest generation. I always use the metaphor of the time machine. I always say that like uh, visiting the art is always, it's like taking a time machine. You can visit the past, which is represented by the historical section. You can visit the present, which is the modern, the contemporary section and you can have a glimpse of the future, uh, having a look at what the, the younger artists are doing with the emerging galleries. So I'm really excited to have this diversity of voices, this diversity of perspective, and I think that this diversity is what we need now to have a look at the complexity of art history.